everyone. So what I got here today is an unboxing of the beta kit for the Ender 3 and Ender, well Ender 3 Pro and Ender 3 V2. This kit is from Cyborg. They, uh, they sent me this kit to review and to get feedback on. Um, so I'm going to do an unboxing and then later I'm going to do a time-lapse video of the build. So um, without further ado, let's get into this and I will show you what's inside of this box. Um, before I open this box, I just do want to let you know that this is a beta box. So um, depending on when the release is, this may change slightly. Um, but the majority of what is in here um, is what will be provided. Have my name here. Obviously, I just cut that off. Pretty dense, packaged pretty well. Um, about an inch thick styrofoam up on it. All right, here we go. Stickers. Everybody loves stickers, right? Those off to the side. Here it is. Ender three conversion switch wire screw kit. Uh, this is going to be very handy. Very nice. quantity of what's inside. Um, you'll use the CAD file mostly to put this together. I'm sure you can get on the Discord and somebody will direct you to that. Alright, so we got the screen over here. Looks like. And This looks like it is an adapter for um, the motherboard for the screen. I'm going to put all this stuff back in here. And then you have an extruder motor. Just over the line. Pretty good. Uh, power source. No power plug. Bearings. This looks like the Stealth Burner PCB. And then obviously two piece. for the bed skirt. Just to cool down all the electronics underneath the build. And then we have 12 24 volts of 5 volt 5 amp. They actually provide a STL file for this. So you can mount it underneath of the switch wire.
And then the stuff for our fans. Uh, which I'm actually really excited if they went with this. Is this, um, they used to use a key back and they're like $15 a piece. So this is a great alternative. I have this on every single one of my builds other than one. Um, I do have a key back on one and honestly I can't tell the difference. They work great, they do the same thing and these are like four bucks on Amazon. Um, one comes in the kit, so it's really nice. And then it looks like you have ADXL wires for the, yeah, ADXL sensor. So you can run an input shaper and all that when you get the build complete. And right here we got some uh, 3M VHV tape. This is going to be for the enclosure. Um, here you got your gates, belts, um, you got your heater, thermometer, switch, and the wiring harness, and the stealth burner LCD, or the LED lights, I mean. So, all this looks like it's already got the um right after on the ends of them um right here is you got the hot end it is just a very simple v6 and they also provide stepper motors new stepper motors um you do have to reuse the stepper motor for the y-axis um, they would provide two of these in this kit. Um, cable chains, uh, all three. Um, these beta kits, I believe they said a couple of these are a little short. Um, they've already got that fixed on the next release. Um, but yes, so there is these. cables. Um, I do know that the next cables will come with a 90 degree bend on them because the way the um, MCU sits in there, you do not have any room to plug in this cable unless it is a 90 degree. Um, so I do know that they will be changing these out with 90 degree angle. Um, here are some power wires. Alright, what it looks like that is the end of the first batch. And we'll put this back in. Stickers. Gotta love stickers, right? That's pretty cool they do that. Over. So we have the rails for the build. These actually look really nice. Um, cyborg. I don't know if you can see how the glare maybe, but. And they also give you a pre cut 2020. So you do not have to cut the one for the conversion. Without this kit, you would originally, they have a STL file. You would slide on this and then cut it down to size. Um, luckily, this kit comes with that, so you do not have to do that. Um, here are the feet. And it looks like the LEDs with the cable. That will be for the enclosure. The eye sheet, gold. And it looks 
like it does come with a magnetic. Verify, yeah, it does come with a, another magnetic plate to put on. Uh, that's all in this one. This is going to be all the enclosure panels. I'm actually very surprised that this kit is coming with the enclosure panels. Um, from what I heard, this kit's going to be very, very affordable. Nothing has been confirmed yet, so I'm not sure exactly, but this is awesome that this kit comes with the enclosure, so that will allow everybody to print. ABS and ASA and all the higher temperature filaments out there. Um, from what I understand, there will be two versions of this kit possibly. Um, one will be this one here, which does not come with any printed parts. You will have to print your own parts for it. Um, I do believe that they are going to have an option for printed parts, um, which will be packaged nice and neat like this one is here. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure on that. I do know as of right now there will not be any printed parts. Um, but maybe at a later date, I do believe they plan on having that. So, um, that's it pretty much. This is the kit and it looks really nice, a lot of high quality. Um, I just hope that they can really hit the price point that people are probably going to want to spend on this. Um, other than that, Hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you have any questions, just leave them in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer them. Um, this video probably won't get released until I get permission to release it since this is still in beta. Um, but if anything changes um, and then it's official, I will also post that in the description below of all the updates that happened. Anyways, uh, thanks for watching and have a blessed day.